Hi, I'm Tony Kerr from Matchfisher Magazine and today we're going to be taking a look at the two latest additions to MAP's seat box range. On my left, I've got a new addition to the range which is the H36 Lite. This box previously was only available in a 30mm 30, 30 leg version. Now it comes with a beefed up 36mm leg. Much better if you, if you want to be wading, you need that extra stability or if you're someone who just wants to scale down the amount of tackle you're taking. MAP produce a wide range of different trays and, and base units and things like that to accompany these boxes. So this box is completely customizable to whatever fishing you're doing. On this side, we got the flagship Z36 Elite Mark II. This again, on appearance, you probably think it's just had a paint job, but other than the striking blue frame that MAP have included on this box, they've included a number of upgrades across both boxes that when they've listened to people who have been using their boxes over the last few years. So what we'll do is we'll go and have a look at those improvements now. The first upgrade they've looked at is the seat itself. This is a fully molded seat there's no stitching on it at all that could fail. Um, it's fully waterproof and it's also uh, covered in a UV resistant uh, covering which stops the sun degrading it over time. On the underside of the seat, you've got a aluminium skeleton built into the underside of the seat. This stops the pressure being put on the drawers underneath, which means when you sat on the box, you don't have any trouble opening, opening the drawers, which is a really nice little feature. Both the boxes, as I mentioned before, come with uh, fully extending 36 mil legs. These are uh, threaded at the end of the, of the legs, so you can fit accessories, pole socks, butt, butt rests, anything like that that you wanna, you wanna use in there. Next up, both of the boxes come with a deep drawer and a shallow drawer. Both of these are fully waterproof with the waterproof seals. So when you're fishing in the rain, you're not gonna get a load of water going into your drawers, which can be really annoying. The hand wheels on both of the boxes have been reversed. This not only sort of stops them being a bit of a snagging point, but also when you fold in the foot plate in, the foot plate closes a little bit closer to the box now. So it's better when space is at a premium if you're traveling in a car. Going over to the Z36 Elite Mark II, another improvement MAP have built into this, which does make quite a nice difference if you forget to take out your cassette system before you've set all your gear up, is that it can be removed from the back now as well. Um, the box comes with a shallow tray unit and the stacker lid itself has also benefited from an upgrade with the aluminium frame on the underside of the lid, which stops a lot of pressure being put on the handle when you're carrying a number of trays. As well as that, the foot plate itself can be fully removed using the uh, supplied Allen key that you get with a box Again, if you're struggling for space or you want to give the box its yearly clean, this is a really nice feature that wasn't possible on the previous boxes. Both of the boxes uh, have locking pins on the foot plate, so the foot plate's locked in place when you're fishing. It's not going to move around and a lot more comfortable. Both of the boxes also come with a seat box cover and a carry strap, um, so Lots and lots of box for your money here. Two great releases from MAP and they're available now from your local MAP stockist. 